Eyes on the Skies A History of UFO Encounters at Nuclear Sites The skies above America's nuclear bases have held a long and unsettling secret. Since the dawn of the atomic age, whispers and rumors have circulated about strange lights and unidentified flying objects appearing near these sensitive installations. These sightings, often reported by highly trained military personnel, paint a picture of sustained interest from unknown forces in humanity's deadliest weapons. From the early days of the Cold War to the present day, these encounters raise profound questions about who or what is observing us and why. The story begins in the late 1940s, shortly after the United States detonated the first atomic bombs, ushering in a new era of warfare. Reports of unusual aerial phenomena began to surface near nuclear research facilities, weapons testing grounds, and missile silos. These sightings were not limited to a single location or time period. They occurred across the country, from the deserts of New Mexico to the forests of Washington state, suggesting a widespread and persistent pattern. The frequency and consistency of these reports, often coming from credible witnesses with military backgrounds, fueled speculation that something extraordinary was taking place. Were these unidentified objects simply advanced aircraft developed by foreign powers? Or could they be something even more profound, hinting at the possibility of extraterrestrial visitation? Whatever their origin, the implications of these encounters were impossible to ignore. Whispers from the front lines, testimonies of military witnesses. These trained observers were tasked with protecting America's most critical assets. Their testimonies provide compelling first-hand accounts of events above nuclear installations. Former U.S. Air Force officer Robert Salas reported UFOs at Malmstrom Air Force Base in 1967. He claims UFOs caused several missiles to malfunction simultaneously. Charles Halt witnessed strange lights near RAF Woodbridge in 1980. Halt and others observed a triangular object hovering silently in the forest. These accounts suggest a phenomenon that cannot be easily dismissed. Decades of interest, patterns, and possible explanations for alien curiosity. Analyzing the numerous reports of UFO activity near nuclear sites reveals intriguing patterns that defy easy explanation. These patterns, when considered alongside the potential technological capabilities of such craft, hint at the motives behind this sustained interest in humanity's nuclear endeavors. One recurring observation is the timing of these encounters. UFO sightings spiked during periods of heightened Cold War tensions, particularly during times of nuclear weapons testing or deployments. This correlation suggests that whoever or whatever is behind these objects is keenly aware of, and perhaps concerned by, humanity's growing nuclear arsenal. Another notable pattern is the apparent interest in the functionality of nuclear weapon systems. Multiple reports describe UFOs hovering near missile silos, sometimes coinciding with unexplained malfunctions or system disruptions. This suggests a level of technological sophistication capable of interacting with and potentially disrupting these complex systems. Why would extraterrestrial beings, if that is indeed what we are dealing with, be so interested in our nuclear capabilities? Some researchers speculate that they may be monitoring our planet for signs of self-destructive behavior, recognizing the existential threat posed by nuclear weapons. Others propose that they may be studying our technology, perhaps seeking to prevent a catastrophic accident or misuse of such destructive power. Viled in Secrecy Government Silence and the Quest for Transparency Despite compelling eyewitness accounts and potential national security implications, governments maintain frustrating secrecy around UFO activity, especially near nuclear sites. This lack of transparency fuels speculation and mistrust, hindering serious scientific investigation. For decades, official policy was to deny UFOs or explain them as misidentified aircraft or weather phenomena. Recently, there's been a shift towards acknowledgement, with governments declassifying documents and admitting some sightings remain unexplained. Despite newfound openness, reluctance to engage in honest dialogue persists, especially regarding nuclear incidents. Researchers argue the time for secrecy is over, the public deserves to know. 
only through transparency can we understand and address this phenomenon.